my deepest sympathies to all of those affected. Throughout the weekend, the nation focused on Poway. Six months after a single gunman killed members of a Jewish temple in Pittsburgh, another lone gunman entered the Chabad of Poway Saturday, injuring three people, including the rabbi, and killing 60-year-old Lori Kay. After being released from the hospital Sunday, Rabbi Yisroel Goldstein emerged from the Chabad of Poway to talk about what he saw on that last day of Passover. I turn around and I see a sight that I undescribable. Here is a young man standing with a rifle pointing right at me. And I look at him. He had sunglasses on. I couldn't see his eyes. I couldn't see his soul. A member of the congregation charged the gunman. Another member of the synagogue, an off-duty member of the Border Patrol from the El Centro sector, fired several shots as he sped away. The mayor of Poway and President Trump called it a hate crime. Obviously, it looks right now, based on my last uh, conversations, looks like a hate crime. There were vigils throughout the weekend as people from San Diego showed support for the Jewish congregation. At the same time, flowers piled up in a makeshift memorial across the street from Chabad of Poway. 19-year-old Josh Ernest was arrested after fleeing the scene. He's charged with one count of first-degree murder and three counts of attempted murder. It's been treated as a hate crime. He's also being charged with igniting a fire outside a mosque on March 23rd. He's expected to be in court Tuesday. Steve Walsh, KPBS News.